what's going on guys? How's everybody doing today? I'm doing well. Thank you for asking. Body beat down here. Trying to eat my pre-workout meal. But I got a little surprise. As y'all know, I collect some action figures. And I like to share it here on the channel because my channel has to do with a lot of things and happiness is one of them. Mental stability, mental happiness, all that good stuff. And these bring me happiness. So let's go ahead and open it up. I'm gonna try and hide my label here. Don't want y'all sending me anything amazing. I'm trying to break into my house and take all my toys. I'm watching you. I'm watching. It always feels like somebody's watching me. And I have no privacy. Oh. oh, oh, oh. Yes, I'm crazy. So this is just another version of this character from the show. Masters of the Re Masters of the Be Masters of the Universe Revelation. It's a series that came on Netflix. Uh, they are actually making another uh, season called Revolution. But this is a character that I've already got. But this is another version of him from the show. It's just a cash grab. It's a cash grab. Let's face it, guys. Hey, let's give them every single version. Hey, if they brush their hair this way, let's give them that version. Stupid. So I'm hoping that everything's in good condition. Hope the box is perfect. Hope everything's nice and tight in the clamshell. Nothing's floating around and being stupid. Let's take a look, guys, at this figure. Man at Arms. Deluxe Man at Arms. The box looks to be perfectly good everything is in the clamshell like it should be beautiful figure this is the only man at arms that we should have gotten to be honest it, it's really all we needed but uh this is cast away shunned pushed out uh, whatever man at arms get out of here so this figure's actually been floating around in some stores now for a couple of months and a handful of people have actually had it it seemed like it started coming out more in like mexico and places like that i don't know or overseas or something some random places and eventually well it went up on target for uh sale so they had it on there but it it would come in stock for about that quick and then out and then that quick and then out and then Basically, the release date, I think the official release date was a couple days ago. So, uh, I noticed it and I jumped on it and ordered it real quick. So, this is Deluxe Man at Arms. And he is a nice looking figure. Got his little story back here on the back that you can't really read because, well, you know, glare and stuff. All the glare. And I've got all these figures down here as well. The box art is always really nice on these, and that's why I am a box collector. One reason. Uh, I don't play with the action figures. I just collect them in box. So, yep. It's a good looking figure, and uh, I'm glad I finally got him. So, uh, anyway, yeah, eventually once I get all these, and I got about... I have 10 on pre-order and there's you know a batch is gonna come out at this point in time and then a batch is gonna come out at this point in time later in 2023 and usually there's a couple of deluxe that are released along the way so as far as I know right now I got 10 on pre-order we're still waiting on deluxe whiplash to become available for pre-order and then I, I'm assuming there's going to be some more scattered around in 2003, which I hope. So 
Uh, I'm really enjoying collecting these. As a kid, I, uh, I collected the original ones uh, in the 80s, uh, the early 80s, all the original stuff. I had pretty much everything you could name. So all the play sets and vehicles and, and all that stuff. But instead of collecting all that, whenever I started this, I went ahead and I just went with these new figures that way. I know I'm getting new stuff. I like the way they look. I think they're a good a good mixture of old and new and it's just uh, and the show is good some people don't like it because they don't like change and they want everything to stay the same as it was 40 years ago I don't I enjoy the change so uh, I, I started collecting these right as that show came out Revelation started collecting these and uh, I don't uh, don't regret it at all I'm enjoying it I like them I like looking at them and once I get them all I'm gonna try and get them all displayed as you can tell in my closet over there I started making a masters of the universe closet I got it all painted black and I got you know all a bunch of figures in there and I was gonna have shelves going all the way down to the floor but I stopped about right there as you can tell and I, got, I think I got three shelves in there and uh, I got the regular man-at-arms in there as well let me go get that I'll show you now don't look at my butt when I'm walking away. <laughs> uh, no, really, don't. So, here's the regular man-at-arms. That's the regular one. Nice looking figure. And this is the one where he was later on in the show it's hard to get these cameras right so pretty good action figure uh, I'm tired of getting duplicates I'd rather them just put out you know new figures so uh, but anyway uh, long video now seven minutes and ten seconds 11 12 13. anyway Guys, I hope you enjoyed my video. I hope you enjoy seeing a little bit of uh, something else that I enjoy doing. In the comments, please, let me know what you enjoy collecting or, or doing. Uh, it don't have to be workout related and all that kind of stuff. Like I said, anything that brings you real joy and happiness. And uh, it can even be toys, video games, drawing, paint, uh, do whatever. Tell me in the comments, guys. All right? Please, if you feel so inclined, maybe like, share, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff to the body beat down Ta-da! get up get out get red do it to it we'll see y'all later get up get out get red and do it to it